In this video, we will describe features and setting method of the real-time output function, which newly added for RCX3 series. The real-time output function is a function that expands the input and output area of the field network and enables to output various information about the robot in real time, such as the robot's current position, error code, motor power supply value, and total operating time. When this function is enabled, the operating status and robot information required for predictive maintenance can be easily grasped on the PLC. The RCX3 series real-time output function is a function that can be used when an option board of Ethernet IP, Profinet, or EthiCat is added. This function is not compatible with CC-Link, DeviceNet, and Profibus. Input and output will be delayed by the data update cycle of the robot controller and field network. For this reason, please note that the data such as the current position acquired by this function is not suitable for use in motion synchronization. Now, we will explain the setting method using Yamaha RCX3 series support software, RCX Studio 2020, using Ethernet IP connection as an example. Connect the controller and PC and launch RCX Studio 2020. Set communication settings and connect to the controller in online mode. Double-click Board Enable in the Parameter folder in the Window tree. Please make sure the Ethernet IP board is valid. Next, set the board parameters. Enable the SIOW extension this extends the RCX3 controller's field network input and output area from the standard 48 words to 256 words. Please note that the input and output area in the PLC side also needs to be extended to 256 words. After entering, click Save button to save the settings to the controller. The message Turn on power again will be displayed. Please turn off the power of the controller and then turn it on again. Set the IP address. Set the subnet mask and default gateway as required. Then double click I.O. in the parameter folder. Enable the flag for real time output. This makes it possible to output various information to the extended output area. Then select what information to output to each output port. Double-click Real-Time Output in the Parameter folder. The 104 words from RT24 to RT127 are areas where data can be output. Click the item name of each device and select the information to output. As an example, we will set to output the current position of the 4-axis robot and alarm information. For data that occupies a double word area, such as the current position, 
Please select the lower address and then the upper address in the order of consecutive addresses. After completing all the settings, please turn off the power of the controller and then turn it on again. Now, the current location information of the specified address is changing on the PLC monitor as the robot moves. If the emergency stop is pressed while the servo is on, the alarm number of emergency stop on will be displayed. That is all for the explanation of the real-time output function. Thank you for watching.